on in. Look at Delray Beach, though, uh, looking just kind of great. Some peaks of sun here or there, though, but also a few showers blowing in from time to time. It's still wave action of really high here with the gusty onshore winds, which will continue again tomorrow. These hard onshore winds here. We do have some rain around, mainly farther south, but we do have a couple of sprinkles. Look at them going right through uh, Martin County and a couple of sprinkles here or there. And, and further down to the south, we're seeing more into Miami-Dade County. Now, a lot of this will start to build and then move up to the north by tomorrow afternoon, and that's when we'll see our rain chances go way up. Even the potential for some heavy rain will be there, too. Temperatures currently holding steady into the 70s, and lows tonight will generally be into the upper 60s to low 70s with some passing showers, windy conditions. Windy again tomorrow, highs upper 70s, cloud cover pretty thick, and also Rain chance is pretty high too, and we've added in thunderstorm chances too, as we'll start to see a lot of this lift up to the north. The morning is okay with just maybe a few spotty showers, but then as we get mid morning to the afternoon, you see this whole mess move up to the north with some heavy rainfall potential there. This will be nice if this happens too, because we really do need it. And that lasts even into the evening hours. See, this is uh, dinner time, 530 or so. You still see uh, some scattered showers around. Tapers off a bit overnight, maybe a coastal shower. Then Thursday, even through lunchtime, finally the sun comes back out. Beautiful. However, with the southwesterly steering flow, we get some showers and storms to blow back towards the coastline. So we'll be in the clear early, but later on for your Thursday evening, there could be a few spotty showers and thunderstorms uh, with some heavy rainfall in some isolated areas. Friday still have some rain chances. It's more of a southwesterly flow. Level two slight risk for excessive rainfall that could lead to flooding from Boca del Rey southward. The rest of us in the level one marginal and that continues on Thursday also for the potential for some heavy rain. So those high rain chances here could cause some flooding. Then we drop rain chances over the weekend. Total rainfall amounts here we could see in anywhere two, three inches or so, a little bit less farther north. So. Much needed rain. If we do get that, that would be nice. Bodie and beach forecast here. East wind still cranking. It's going to be pretty rough out there. Another two days. It'll calm down Friday through the weekend, though. Uh, 70s. Then once we see more sun Thursday, Friday, we get to the 80s. Even over the weekend, the upper 80s for highs. Another cold front coming on Monday, upping rain chances then.